Okay, we're rolling, so go ahead. You're rolling? I'm rolling. Hey, this is Matthew Bauer with 4002 and You, and I am here with Jessica and Alyssa, and they're here with Foster Erie, who is our charity for this month. Um, can you guys tell me a little bit about Foster Erie and what you guys do? Um, yeah, so Foster Erie is um, in the community to bring awareness to foster care um, and to our foster children and our foster youth. Um, we are looking at recruiting, um, but we're also looking at how to meet the needs of current foster families and foster kids in Erie County. So when you say recruiting, what do you mean by recruiting? Yeah, so recru So there is, um, on any given day, there are about 400 kids in foster care in Erie. Wow. And um, in, in a home or looking for a home? Well, that's, that's in home, that's in shelters, that's in group homes, um, that's, that's kids, that's kids um, in any, any facility. Um, and there is always a constant need because um, there are kids constantly coming into care, unfortunately. Wow, I never realized there was that many. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, so um, obviously you're our charity of the month. So what do you guys do? Like what, what need do you fulfill other than the recruiting portion? Um, so we offer support uh, to foster families. Um, we meet once a month. Um, we either do a fun activity with them, um, family friendly, and it's no cost to the foster family, or we offer trainings to our families. Um, being a foster parent um, is, is a lot of work, um, and there <laughs> is a lot of training that can go into that as far as just how to um, parent a child who has been from a hard place. So how, how old are most of these children? Um, they range anywhere from zero to 18. Wow, mm -hmm. that's crazy. So with this being this month's charity, we obviously give a donation. What would you guys, or what do you think you'll do with the donation? So we hold an annual bag drive. It's called the Foster Erie Placement Bag Drive. And uh, what we do with that is people donate filled bags with um, several essential items that are then given to the foster children as they come into placement. Um, because Jess was saying that, you know, there's 400 children any given day in foster care. But the process of bringing those children into foster care is quick, it's rushed, so these children are being taken from their homes as quickly as possible, and sometimes they leave with nothing, or if they are able to take some of their items with them, it's quickly put in a uh, garbage bag and they're out the door. Um, so the idea with this placement bag drive is that these children being removed from these chaotic situations are going to be given this bag filled with things like pajamas, um, toothbrush, toothpaste, a stuffed animal, a book, things that um, could be their own, they can put their own things in, um, just something that, you know, helps them to feel like they're valued and in this time when it seems like they're kind of being pushed to the side, they have something to kind of hold on to. Um, we've been told by caseworkers that, um, you know, it's been great to have these bags because sometimes uh, when they come into care, there isn't a home immediately available for them. So I've had caseworkers tell me that they have these bags. They've taken blankets right out of the bag and they've wrapped the kids up in them. They pull out the book for them to sit and look at while they're waiting. And then everything just goes right with them when they find their home. So um, that's the goal with this bag drive. Uh, last year and the year before, this will be the third year that the bag drive has happened. In the last two years, we collected over 600 bags to be given to children in foster care. So that would be what we would use the money towards is filling bags so that we can reach even more kids. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. So if somebody else wants to donate or they can they volunteer time? Absolutely, so yes. So how do they do that? Like if they if they want to get a hold of you guys, what do they do? Um, they can visit the Foster Erie page. Uh, there will be opportunities during our bag drive. Um, we like to have as much help as we can collecting the bags. We have a distribution center um, in Erie where they can take the bags. Then at the end of the drive, we have a sorting and tagging day. We go through all the bags just to make sure everything is in there that needs to be in there, make sure there's no dangerous items, food items, that type of thing. So we love volunteers for that to help us go through the hundreds of bags that we get. Um, and then we deliver them to foster care agencies um, throughout Erie County. Cool. Mm -hmm. You guys have a website? 
Um, there, the best way right now is to go on Facebook, um, and there is a Foster Erie Facebook page. So if you just Google up at the or like search up at the top Foster Erie, um, that should pull up, and the bag drive information will be right there. Also, other ways to get involved um, as we continue to grow and, and reach more children. Great. So it's Matt Bauer. I'm here with Jessica and Alyssa talking about Foster Erie. So if you want to get involved or you want to donate, you can go to their Facebook page. Thank you. Thank you.